So we want to rewrite y equals 4 times 7.8 to the x in terms of base e. So if we have to write this in terms of base e, that means we've got to figure out a way to write it so that the base e is going to cancel out. And the only way that I can get that to cancel out is if I use e and the natural log. Sounds kind of intuitive, so let's see if that works. So if I need to do that, to get it to cancel out, I'm going to have to have e to the ln. That's what I'm going to need in order for those to cancel out, because remember, e to the ln of x equals x. So if I apply that principle to what I already see, then that would be 4e, and then I would have the ln of 7.8 times x. Because remember, the x is already raised to it up there. So if I do that, is there any way that I can simplify that? Well, I could have 4e, and then I could actually multiply out the natural log of 7.8. So if I find the natural log of 7.8, it's going to be a long number. Let's say we want three decimal places just to be kind of pretty. So this would be 2.054. X, and that's all that you're going to have to do. Um, it's pretty straightforward. Let me kind of give you a little insight over here when I did this. Uh, originally I had 4 times 7.8 to the X, and so when I substituted in, I just substituted in for the 7.8, and I did that E to the LN of 7.8, so that whole thing was still the X. So that's how my justification is for the um, e to that power. So it's going to be 4e to the ln of 7.8 times x.